away. The girls and I are getting ready for a big trip. You girls are being so helpful, aren't you? Yeah, you are. I set you guys up on a tripod for this because last time it was a very bad setup where the camera could have fell. So I was responsible and I put you guys on a tripod. I know what you guys are thinking, a trip? Gina, you guys said you weren't traveling in August and September. And that didn't work out very well because we went to the beach in August, which by the way, so worth it. It was amazing and we had such a great time. But now we're going to Colorado in September, a month before the wedding, which is very stressful, very crazy of us, but I am super excited and I think it's gonna be a great time. The really crazy part is we're taking the girls. Now, to be fair, we had a trip planned in May and we were supposed to go and this was supposed to be well before the wedding and everything was supposed to be great, but it snowed like crazy, the roads were closed, trails were closed, so we had to cancel the trip. So now we're going in September and we decided we wanna bring the girls because we've always dreamed of it. We've always 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 wanted to take them there it's just been a really big dream of ours so of course this trip we decide why don't we take the girls let's be really crazy like i said really excited about it but definitely a little nervous because all of our past experiences flying with dogs has been very, very bad. We are going in this with the mindset that it's not gonna go over well. So we're prepared for the worst. I'm trying to be as prepared as possible. I have their paperwork here. So all of their records of shots, rabies and everything. So the girls are good to go with that. This is gonna be the carrier that they are going to be in. It's really big, but I read the measurements and everything and it lines up, but I guarantee you we're gonna go there day of and they're gonna say it's too big. So hopefully that doesn't happen. The really cool thing about this carrier is it opens up on every single side. So there's compartments on every side that fold out. So once we're on the plane and we get them all situated, we can open these up and they'll have more room to stretch out, especially Piglet. Oatmeal fits great in this, but Piggy, you know, she's a little bit of a big girl. This little bag that I have here is what I take for the girls whenever we travel to go to the beach or whatever. This is their little suitcase and it's super nice. I got it on Amazon and I am so glad that I did it. If you guys are thinking about getting a little travel bag, highly recommend instead of like carrying all of the dog stuff. This is just really, really convenient. Now we aren't traveling for about five-ish more days. So this next clip is going to be travel day and I guess I'll see you guys then. All right, you guys, I did not film at all this morning because it was very overwhelming. I got surprised with my two best friends coming along on this trip, which was insane and a lot to take in. And I was very focused on getting the girls to the airport because as you guys know, I was very stressed about this trip and flying with them. But I had another surprise from Mr. Michael and um, we're on a private jet. <laughs> Babe, what? <laughs> well, you know, we're only getting married once. So this is our last trip before the wedding. Wanted to do something special. We always talked about it. And I figured, why not have a little fun? So we chartered a jet. I looked up a service. Steve with them, is, I looked up the reviews. He was great. Privatejetcharter.com. And they give you, tell them where you want to go. They give you a few options. And we are currently on a Beautiful Cessna Citation X, super comfy. It's got Wi-Fi, and uh, yeah, it was actually actually really easy to charter a jet. So here we are. This is really insane. I I gave a very good reaction to my friends this morning because like that was the one surprise. I cried. It was this big thing. I think I'll talk about it more in the next vlog and also put the video in the next vlog. But then hearing this news. I, I was like surprised out. I was totally shocked. Like it was way too much to take in. So I'm starting to get over the shock factor and we're starting to enjoy ourselves. Mike filmed a lot on the GoPro, so I'm gonna put that footage in here. And he didn't do much of an intro either because he was so stressed out and excited about today. But we'll definitely switch to the GoPro footage now because I have not been vlogging very much. Are you ready, babe? I'm ready. Everyone's here in the truck. Ernie is ready for a big flight. I'm not oh ready actually, my. I'm so nervous. How are you feeling? <laughs> really nervous. You're nervous about flying with the dogs? Mm-hmm. That's alright, it's gonna be fine. We have their carriers, we have their paperwork, everything's good to go. We've never had an easy flying day. That's true. With either one of them, so. And now That's we're true. flying with both of them. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little <laughs> bit nervous. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't, a little bit. But I think it'll work out. I am shaking nervous, but it's happening now. We're getting on the private jet. This is a big surprise and uh, have never done anything like this. Should be pretty cool. I've got our bags of snacks. We've got everything. Oh, oh, oh. This is different out onto the runway. It's gonna be a little bit noisy, a little windy, but we're heading to the jet now. Oh my God, I cannot wait to do this. Babe, are you excited? I'm freaking out. She's freaking out. She had no idea until 
roughly two minutes ago that this was happening. So she's totally overwhelmed. Ernie's Look ready. Look at her go. <laughs> on the runway. They are on the runway right now. <laughs> this is so overwhelming. This is so insane. God, I am sweating. This is crazy. I'm sweating so I'm freaking out. We are in fact on a private jet right now. <laughs> We're on a private jet right now, babe. With the girls. This is our dream forever. I can't believe this is happening. Oh my God. I can't believe this. <laughs> Ernie, are you ready is the question. You look ready. Are we ready for takeoff? No. We're ready for takeoff? No. I'm facing the wrong way. You're backwards. <laughs> what if we don't make it off the ground? Mike makes me watch so many scary videos. Look at this. We're already going 300 mile an hour. Oh my god. Whoa. Well, we were right down there. Now we're up here. Piglet is loving life and up here they have snacks and drinks all in this cabinet space here and then this is really cool these shades come down automatically by that button it's so crazy and then there's obviously switches for lights and everything a bunch of cup holders it comes with Fiji water every seat had Fiji water with it. In the middle here, a big tray comes out, which we have out back here. One of the really weird things though is there's a bathroom back here, which is awesome, but it's interesting. That's the toilet. It's cushioned like a couch. We've yet to open it, but that's the toilet with a cool sink. Yeah, I'm afraid to use it. I actually have to pee, but I'm scared. I don't know why. It just freaks me out that it looks like that. And they also have little pillows and blankets for you to be nice and comfortable and right now we're about 43,000 feet up that's insane well this was one of the best experiences of our life it's coming to an end we are actually currently landing this is not good because <laughs> man obviously we, we do not have the lifestyle to do this when we travel but like it's gonna be really hard to go back. This is it is. Incredible. Ooh, it's bouncy, bumpy. Well, I'm actually gonna wrap up this vlog here. This was just our little travel day vlog, and the next vlog is going to be our actual Colorado trip. So this was insane. I I can't even describe <laughs> the way I was feeling today, and I have a lot to say, but I just can't even put it into words right now. So. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next one when we are in Colorado.